The Earth is a beautiful and intricate object in the cosmic playground. It has water, air and soil that have enabled life to bloom out of every nook and corner. It has winds that blow and seasons that change. It has days and nights and a lot lot more. But let's suppose this wasn't so. What do you think would happen if the world stopped going round and round? Well, This question, although bizarre, is neither a futuristic scenario nor is it science fiction. What it is, is a fun thought experiment of an extremely improbable yet fascinating question. Fascinating because everything that we spoke of of happening on the Earth happens because the Earth spins or rotates about its own axis. But what makes the Earth spin in the first place? To answer that, let's recall Newton's first law of motion. The first law of motion basically says that if an object is at rest, then it wants to continue to stay at rest. Or if it's in motion, it wants to remain in motion with the same speed and in the same direction unless an external force acts upon it. This behavior is what we term as inertia. So getting back to our earlier discussion, the Earth, the Sun and the whole solar system experiences no external force. Thus, we keep spinning the way we started out, round and round because of inertia. Now back to our original question, what if the Earth stopped spinning? Well, for starters, when the Earth suddenly stops from a crazy speed of about 1700 kilometers per hour, the effects will be, well, apocalyptic. Everything that is not fixed firmly to the Earth, including us, will be thrown sideways. Why? Because of inertia. Now, except for maybe objects at the poles, but even those will eventually be thrown off too. Everything else will continue to travel at that crazy speed, including and importantly, our atmosphere. Now, this would create multiple gusts of wind, each with the same impact as an atomic explosion. The water in the ocean would also remain in motion. Why? Because of air currents. And within a minute, these would cause colossal tsunamis. So in a nutshell, our ecosystem as we know it today will be wiped out completely. What else would happen? What do you think would happen to days and nights? Well, if the Earth stopped rotating around its axis, but continued to revolve around the sun, for starters, a day, which is 24 hours now, will be equal to 12 months. There will be 6 months of daytime and 6 months of nighttime. In the daytime, the side facing the sun would bake to a crisp due to the constant heat of solar energy. While the side facing against the sun would see temperatures plummet. This would result in giant storms that would rage for a long, long time. Now, this was just a hypothetical scenario, right? And we haven't even seen 1% of the things that would actually go wrong if the Earth were to suddenly stop spinning. But it is true that the Earth is slowing down. According to a study, a day is getting longer by 2.3 milliseconds every 100 years. And in about 100 million years from now, a day will be longer at 25 hours. But for the Earth to really slow down and stop spinning altogether, it would take ages and eons. Who's to say we'll even stick around till then? Right now, my life hasn't stood still and I have more pressing problems to address like what to eat for lunch today or why I forgot to charge my phone last night. Cut! Hey, uh, do you have a charger that I can borrow by any chance? To understand and learn more concepts this way, all mapped your syllabus, download Baiju's The Learning App. Hey guys, I still need that charger. Anybody? Anyone? Guys, power bank?